bastard had to die. <laughs> Honey, you, you got a, a little... Uh, yeah, right there, Get yeah. Welcome back, awesome people, to Cocktails and Consoles. It's Melissa, and let's go put the screws in Falcone. And by screws, I mean in his knee after we break it. Hey, how's the tetanus? Children of Arkham. Oh, this doesn't bode well. The hell, Bruce Wayne. Hi, douchebag. Some clout. <laughs> My own wife can't get in to see me. Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. It's like a mausoleum in here. We need to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met. But then... Well, now I'm the only one with the working liver. Especially after the press got their teeth in here. <laughs> Please. You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. Tommy. More than friends. More like cousins. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by I now. I will break your I neck. I tried to get through to you at Dent's party. But you, you showed me the door. Convince me then. Tell me a story about our big, happy family. <laughs> There it is. Now I got you hooked. Your father, Hill, and me, we ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? How about I stick it in your eye? I don't like this either way. Because if he overdoses, I'm liable. But if I hurt him, I'm liable. Forty years I keep my veins clean of any of that gunk. I'll Just take it all, bitch. It'd be so easy to give me the whole vial, wouldn't it? Enough there to put an old dog down forever. Of course, you'd never know the whole story. How much of your parents do you have in you? What kind of son did Thomas Wayne make? I'm not a murderer. No, you're not. That's why you were kept in the dark. Much better, kid. That's an odd thing to say. Just you like that reminds me of your mother. Your father may have been the doctor, but Martha, she had the human touch. Think you got more of her in you, tell the truth. Well, I wouldn't know. You took her from me when I was nine years old. What, you really think I hired Chill? Sure. Yeah. I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those Duh. you call friend. Your parents learned that now. They're waiting for you in hell. Who psychopath? The bastard had to die. <laughs> Honey, you, you got a, a little... Yeah, right there. Get yeah. Out. Stand down. Get a doctor. Secure this floor. No one gets in or out. Go. Go. One in the chest, one in the head. She knew what she was doing. Timing fucking sucks. Okay, we're turning off the cameras. <laughs> Hmm. 
we are in deep shit. Uh, I bought us some time, but not much. Word's gonna get out, sooner or later. Why would she do something like this? We had Gotham's biggest crime lord in our grasp. I don't, I don't know. I hardly recognized her when she burst in. She was so different from the woman we met in the hall. Ah, it's a disgrace. Another officer gone rogue. No, Just nerve agent. Sense. She'd never do anything to hurt the department. Falcone's case. You know that if she just made out with some cocaine. Victims. And now it is a PR disaster. How can I run against corruption when our own cops are redecorating the precinct with their prisoners' brains? Listen, we gotta get up in front of this. We gotta spin yeah, it. Yeah, I know. This can. is so challenging Issue a for you. We have a shooter in custody. Details are still coming in, and we're investigating. The usual. Oh, time Slow out down, here, douchebag. The facts first. Mm -hmm. The simple fact is she walked in and shot him. Then we need the complex facts, like how and why. Lieutenant, uh, Mr. District Attorney, uh, Falcone's lawyers are here. Oh, Christ. I can delay them for a little while, but we still need answers. Then get out and let us get them. Tell me if she says anything. I have to know why she did this. Yeah, I think we all do. Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God. I'm looking into it, but I'll need access to the back computer for anything I find. Connection secured. Alfred, I'm gonna try and confirm some suspicions of mine. Do you wanna share them, Ansem? Uh, so that is... Fresh injection site. That doesn't look like blood. No. Her veins still visible beneath her skin. If she becomes no, I a I found zombie, analyze and forward me the results. Then this became really cool. Of course, I'll be in touch as soon as I have the results. Where am I, Mr. Wayne? What's going on? Oh, but I got this awful feeling something terrible happened. Easy, easy, Sergeant. Gordon and I are going to get you through this. Through this? Oh, God. Falcone. What have I done? I you believe you were tell trying, so us? I... It would explain a lot. Listen. You have to believe me. I talk big about hurting thugs like Falcone. But I would never, never betray the lieutenant. Everything is so I kind of believe her. I remember a sharp pain. There's an injection side on your neck. Then I just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt. No consequence. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was going to get off. And all I knew was that I had to stop that. I had to. No matter what, the reasons why I shouldn't, they were a million miles away. D did you see a face? Could you ID a suspect? I... I don't think so. You must remember some detail. Try. I remember a hand on my arm, guiding me like a parent with a child. The voice, it was saying something about revolution. Cobblepot said something similar. I forgot about that. I'm so sorry, Lieutenant. I've let you down. We stalled Falcone's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. How is she? Did she tell you anything? Yeah, hey, hey, don't worry about that now. I found evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. Hey, I do. Of course I do. Hey, get for I like that guy. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. 
That's not much to go on. Well, no, this is what we got. Him, let's get Bruce out. Alfred, I gotta get back to the manor. I've got a lead on whoever's behind this. Bruce! And look who's here. What are you doing here? My friends in the, in the GCPD have been telling stories about some kind of lockdown? I'm, I'm sorry, Vicky. I, I don't have time. Don't brush me off. Word is there were shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, you must have been back there when it happened. Where did you get that? So it's true? <laughs> no, I didn't say that. Word is you turned over enough dirt on Falcone to put him in Blackgate prison for life. A day after he showed up at your house. Yeah, and? And now you're here. You can't afford to be associated with another scandal. I can keep your name out of whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shots? A, a cop? I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something happened. Mm -mm. I don't Good trust pressure. her. You don't have anything. Now if you'll excuse me. You should talk to me, Bruce. This is coming out whether you stonewall me or not. Good. Go get the fucking details yourself, lady. I don't trust her at all. I mean, as much as she complains that Bruce is everywhere convenient, so is she. And I'm the Batman. Either Cobblepot drug Montoya himself or someone else is using his revolutionary rhetoric. Either way, I need to find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. In the meantime, we have to find out what we can do about this drug. The computer's been analyzing the chemicals from Montoya's bloodstream. Throw that up on the monitor. How did they get it? The from a picture? My Montoya, god, iPhone. Similar to the nerve agent I found for dogs. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Who'd have guessed that how he'd meet his maker? Prone in his sick bed, surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Murder at the hands of Montoya. That's not justice. Whoever did this was judge, jury, and execution. Okay, so he brought up a good point. I didn't think no, about that. If those are truly three, Falcone's nerves, he told you something chemicals? before he was killed. What did you learn from him? Practically family, he said. Family? Funny, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. It wasn't Falcone who called the hit. Yes, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points. And they probably had Falcone's. dirt on each other, which is why. But then who sent chill? The men at the docks were doused with the base chemicals. The reaction was messy. They were out of control. Mm hmm. This refined drug is like a weapon. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but dragging others to fight them for you? Oh. Considering the amount they stole from Falcone, it it's what Umbrella did. Remorseless assassins. The thought is chilling. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot. Gotham location. City just became Raccoon City. Let's go for the outskirts. Bingo! Yeah. Cobblepot didn't like to be in the center square. So it's basically just anywhere in here. Bring me her head. All 
Are we triangulating the location? go. The Skyline Club. The Skyline Club. Jesus, didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce. Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Let's bring in some muscle. Ooh. Ooh, I'm loving this. I... I mean, I don't know what Cobblepot could be after, but it makes sense that if he got a hold of that nerve agent, he would probably use it to his own gains, and his own gains would be nothing that would be organized. It would just be chaotic, which is basically his nature. Uh, curious to hear what you guys think and how you guys are liking this. Uh, can I please wrap up this episode? <laughs> Any likes, comments, subscribes, as usual, much appreciated. Definitely helps out the channel, and I will see you, detectives, in the next episode. Cheers!